What's up guys, Kickster Dom is here with a new segment, and here's your stencil video you guys been waiting for. This huge episode goes out with a shout out to my new sponsor, Overspray, which this video is going to be about. Overspray provides some quality vinyl stencils, custom stencils, and reusable stencils. And uh, from what they tell me, they're going to be coming out with some new customizing tools that we could use in the future. So uh, here's what they gave me. They gave me this pretty cool package. Um, let's see, we got the squeegee. We got some stencils. Uh, what else we got in here? There we go. Weeding tool. Okay, guys, so what I got in this care package is this squeegee, which you do need for vinyl stencils. Okay? Um, it's very necessary. It seems like we got this weeding tool. It's a little pen with a really sharp edge to peel off the stencils without having to try to use dull X-Acto knives and stuff like that. Um, so those are that's the toolkit that you guys will need. Um, seeing as we got this pretty cool vinyl snakeskin stencil, uh, I'm gonna have fun with this later. I don't know what I'm gonna use it on yet, but if you look at the cuts, it's very precise on point. Uh, I did ask for special custom stencils for this video for you guys everybody wanted to know how I did the sneakerhead in the bay rooster stencils so these are what I'm gonna show you guys how to use they do have them on site limited edition they will only be selling them for a limited time they have a sheet that you could buy if you use my coupon code kickserdamis15 you get 15% off your purchase of $20 or more so I will write that below uh, these are what everybody's raving about. This is the reusable high quality stencil. Uh, a lot of airbrushers seem to use these type of things. I, I, I make my own, but now I don't have to, which is awesome. Make sure to follow Overspray Collection on Instagram and on their Facebook. There's the hashtags and everything. And it seems on the back they're showing all seven of their different reusable stencils that they have currently. Which is pretty cool so uh, I will show another video soon on how to use these I'll give you a quick rundown in this video but it's pretty awesome look at this uh, we got camo print everything this this is awesome guys this is gonna revolutionize the customizing game and uh, even people that can't draw and stuff you know stencils will help you get this quality you know product and some quality customs will start coming out more and more thanks to this company so remember overspray collection so uh, let's let's get into the gist of it so um, you know we got these custom vinyl roosters from what I used on the sriracha 6 custom for sneakerhead in the bay I had to make me a couple so I could do this video um, for all you fans sneakerhead sneakerhead in the bay fans yes go grab yours now and uh, yeah man let's do this I'm gonna put these on a uh, Air Force one I already used leather preparer on this area uh, you need to do it before you paint so the paint will adhere and uh, I'm gonna slap it on there I'm gonna show you guys how to use this this is this is some really cool tools um, it's a lot of fun you know uh, it makes you feel really good about your work after you're done with the crisp lines so let's, let's get going so uh, we're gonna use the rooster on the sixes what I did was I put the rooster on so anything that I painted the rooster remained white but this time we're gonna paint the rooster red so uh, let's get that going all right so we got the weeding pen and I'm gonna show you guys how to use it to apply so with the weeding pen what it does is it makes it very easy for you to remove the parts of the stencil that you will not be using so it's sharp and you just pretty much touch it in the corner you want pull up and the vinyl will come off but uh, you know what I'm just gonna start from the top on this one look how easy it is to remove this stencil with this pen slowly you want to slowly peel off what you're not using so you don't peel up the other surface the other part of the vinyl and there you go this is going to the trash there we go so we have the stencil here and uh, should come with some transfer paper let me see if I got that here somewhere look in this bag okay got it so 
Your stencils will come with some transfer paper that you will use to transfer the stencil onto the shoe. What you would easily do is remove the transfer paper, the transfer sticky paper, and then you would apply it to your stencil that you're going to be using like so and this is where the squeegee comes in you can use you know a quarter a penny and stuff like that but with the squeegee you easily get no air and you get a flat pressure onto the stencil so everything comes off at once it makes it very easy so it's it's pretty pretty useful it's a really good kit and uh, it's not expensive either just to add with the stencil you know you get those twenty dollars and use the code and you get the you get the money off you're winning so once it's applied you got it on there thick and you got it on there pretty tight with the pressure with the squeegee peel it off and it all comes off onto the transfer paper now it's like a sticker so you have the stencil and now let's apply it onto the shoe apply it like so and BAM once you got it on there, you start to peel off the transfer paper slowly so the sticker vinyl sticks to the shoe and that's the only thing on there. And after that, just use your finger, you know, push down on it so it's there's no air bubbles going through. Like so. That way when you paint on it, you don't get any paint under the seams or under the vinyl. So we do that and then what I'm going to do is mask around. I'm going to show you guys how to do this with a sponge brush. Uh, I believe Overspray said they're going to be carrying some sponge brushes for stencils soon, so keep an eye out for that. It makes life a lot easier. Uh, you could use an airbrush, but a lot of people don't have airbrushes, and I want to make a video that's easy and shows everybody how to do it, even if you don't have an airbrush nearby. So let's mask this area. Now that I have everything masked on the shoe, uh, everything around the area so I don't get any red on the white area we're gonna get the red paint where do I have it okay I'm using chili red you know that's the color I used on the sriracha sixes so I'm gonna use that on the logo and uh, the sponge that I'm using I got it from a local art store Michaels you could get it anywhere uh, these are pretty cool you know easy little utensils um, overspray should be carrying some soon but they will also have stencil brushes that will make life a lot easier for you as well so uh, keep an eye out for that what you want to get is a, a good amount of paint not too much and you don't want to brush it you want to dab it on there if you're using this method just dab it on there on top of the stencil very lightly light coats as you dab it on there it starts to lay there flat and then once you got a solid coat you let it dry and uh, once you got it dry then you can start peeling off the tape slowly you don't want to peel the other vinyl by accident and move anything and then there you go we take off the vinyl slowly and you got yourself a crisp image so keep in mind guys, you guys could get uh, custom stencils done by them, teams, uh, any logos, any designs that you guys need. Just go to their website and hit the contact us button on the bottom of the web page or you could go to their custom inquiry page and uh, they got several options. Um, now let's give you a rundown real quick of these sh sh airbrush shields. Um, a lot of you guys already have airbrush guns and you guys have tried probably making your own stencils, doing blends with with cardboard or, or you know different types of thick sheets, but this is going to make your life a lot easier. I make my own um, Galaxy stencils, but now I don't have to with these. I could keep reusing them and I never have to make more. So check this out. It's the, the Galaxy reusable stencil comes with three parts. And uh, as you can see, there's like a flexible film and it has a smoke cloud licking edge to it. And I like to use that a lot. I make my own. And um, what you want to do is you would hold it firm, hold it towards the shoe and use the airbrush and just lightly go around the edges and you're going to get that cloudy film. You use different colors to achieve different types of galaxies and this is going to make your work look 10 times 
more legit, which is great. They're very cheap. They're only $15 and they're reusable. So, I mean, you just keep going with them. For, you. For all you guys that love doing Galaxy Customs, this is, this is the next step right here. So, flexible so you could hold them around the edges of shoes. You know, you could even apply a little bit of tape and hold it there and you could just do it that way. There's several ways to do it, but uh, very easy to use, guys. You guys can't go wrong with this. I mean, you got stars, you got the moon, you got different cloud textures. You got a nice moonlight looking thing right here. You got, it, it's, the possibilities are endless with these stencils. Uh, overspray, definitely legit, guys. Remember to use my code, KICKSTERDIAMONDS15, 15% 15 off your order of $20 or more. Take advantage of it right now. Uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of videos with this. and Make sure to purchase the Vinyl Stencil Toolkit. I mean, this is it's cheap for the kit. It's a really good deal. Um, the pen is very durable, from what I'm told. It won't break. And then you, you know... You got your choices of stencils and stuff so i can't wait to do the next video later for you guys i have a few big videos coming up soon for some brands that hook me up with some gear uh for the app snups snups is a really dope app so be looking out for that video shout out to sneakerhead in the bay for uh allowing me to do that that rooster stencil catch you guys later